what's good what's up my islanders family welcome back to your weekly dose of vloggy vloggy vlog because i know i have a lot of new subscribers over here and now it's your time to shine if you're new over here drop location where are you watching from if you don't want to say exactly where tell me which country if a Jamaica which parish let me know down in the comment section and welcome to you a special welcome my new subs I see you guys I see you all you just saw I'll show you a little montage of me cleaning uh, my stove as well as my microwave so this is a gentle reminder to you remember to clean your microwave the microwave is one of the appliances in the house that often gets left behind and we use it so often right so a gentle reminder to clean your microwave so I'm about to in the kitchen you know so it's about some food not only about cleaning but we have a of course that is for your hunger so i go do what's new eggs <laughs> have it with some waffles so that is that i have not drink coffee in such a long time and i think it's too late now to actually drink any because if i drink it i'm gonna be problem to sleep tonight but Unless we can make some chocolate with a little tip of coffee, you need to call it a mocha. It's kind of very overcast today, so if you see this beaming light shining down on me, it's because I have to take one of my lights into the kitchen. Even though the kitchen light is on, on the outside, it's very overcast, look like it's about to rain. I'm almost sure so I get some rain today, based on what I'm looking at on the outside, so that's what we're doing i don't know what this vlog would be about this is a random week in my life so that is what he'll be getting for this week nothing really planned yeah so let's get cooking now and then i think i'm gonna come back in the kitchen i'm gonna take you guys because i'm gonna season i have chicken here i'm gonna season this chicken i want i want jerk chicken for sunday so i'm gonna season it and i'm gonna show you how i do uh, my jerk usually i make my barbecue not barbecue i normally make my jerk season from scratch but i won't be doing that today because i actually have jerk seasoning in the fridge that we purchased but i'm gonna show you how i incorporate that with my little own twist i don't know what you can bag or nothing but, but still i can show you because i have nothing else to show so anyway guys make sure you like up the video make sure you comment not no matter what just comment on the video it helps my videos to get pushed out i was hoping to reach 10k by august it don't look like it's like a ham but you know them say never say never so let us see have my breakfast now from a tea get cool and i'll catch you guys back in a few this is a burger get expensive a thousand dollars just for um the whopper wow it's gone all the days when two thousand dollars could have buy like feed of maybe six people in a fast food line literally two chicken sandwich and Irish spy get laid them a two thousand dollar this should give me back have this now I don't know who else mixes mayo with ketchup you need to try this combo if you don't know about it all right guys as promised this is the following day um we my chicken I'm actually going to go ahead and clean up and wash my chicken so I'm just gonna add some vinegar into my water chicken the spread the skin is still on it i won't be stripping off the skin since i'll be jerking i go show you the way oh follow me follow me i go show you the way oh c'est la vie no movie i go show you the way all right so i'm up for my wet seasoning i'm gonna use uh, this ethan's jerk sauce that i had before normally i use the Grease in my or water. So I'm going to go through this. For me, eyes only, but I 
body in motion with her eyes on me Her ex-boyfriend sent the guys on me Turn around when they saw the nine on Even though they said it's having everything If you want your dirty chicken for slap, you have to season it twice Follow me. I go show you the way. Follow me. Follow me. I go show you the way. C'est la vie. No movie. I go show you the way. For my spices, I have some pimento seeds and I have just one star anise. So I'm gonna go ahead now and crush these. Yeah. You've been searching, searching, searching in the wrong place. This is pimento and star anise, as I said. Searching, 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 yeah. You've been searching, searching, searching. I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil so I can work my seasoning in. I know that you've been here before. It's different this time. You have me on your side. Follow me. Follow me. Hey, peeps. What's up? Actually, I am heading out in a few. I'm actually so excited today, guys, because I'm going to meet one of my subscribers, Yannick. Wake up yourself, my darling. I'm going to meet her for a quick little bite. I'm not sure if she'll want to be on camera. I didn't remember to ask her before. So I guess when we get there, if you see her, you see her. Probably you hear her voice. If not, if you don't want to be on camera, you know, make respect everybody's privacy. Yeah, but I'm going to give you a quick run through as I realize I have my natural hair out because I just pull out some braids on this uh, dress onto it and then I have on these mules. I've had these mules for so long. I have had a pull and a pull to save them dry rats. Right? <laughs> and I'm going to take this little crossbody bag. I'm an explosion and that smile's going to be the end of me. Guys, at the gas station, I'm going to party. Hi, card machine working. I'm heading up by Hell Shots. I say the time overcast. I thought it was it was gonna rain today. Let's take each other out. Yeah, 
Hey guys, <coughs> morning. I'm actually now in Clarendon. Just made a stop at the the Juicy Beef here at Clarendon Park. Actually, in the drive-through, I'm um, getting something to eat now. Heading to Sainty. What's new? <coughs> you realize a girl now wake it. I'm so tired. I got up too early this morning. I tried uh, falling back asleep, and that just that didn't happen. So. My extremely tired extremely fatigued so I get some of it eat no um, didn't even do like a full outfit just wearing a t-shirt and this is the pants here have on my crocs and my favorite lens <laughs> Good afternoon, welcome to oh. the Pate's Speaking Ready. May I take your order? Good afternoon. Um, can I get two beef patties? Yes. Two cheese patties? Uh-huh. A large um a large serving of fries. Yes. And two bottles of water. Two? Two water. Yes. That's it. So two beef, two cheese, a large fries, and two water. Yeah. 1420 for your total. Okay. Afternoon, 183. Can you change one of them water to room temp for me, please? area just looking around you hear the have like some fall grass not so much good lights in and I love none of them <laughs> I just wanna leave it all behind yeah I'm breaking up with you Nice. I want two like these. But I would actually screen paint. Maybe this color like in a gold. Look like. Mm, too colorful. Pretty pretty. Yeah. <laughs> One piece. For one piece, yeah, them expensive, you know. And then them smaller one, yeah. But they want to have more leaf, no. Not really, five hundred on. Let them here get out of there. Them stuff there. But you won't feel the pain alone. No. So they have these uh, flower bamboo, which I am really contemplating getting because um, normally Azans have a lot of these, but they normally come like everything is all together in one and uh, they're very expensive. So one of these is for $771 per stem. So from the floor of so I'm actually considering getting maybe like three stems. I forgot to put no one vase to see how it looks. One more trick that I say. I mean, I put my vase to post them. Yeah, to make it look yeah. like this. So get one more on the tree. All right. Okay, the tree is good, but yeah, but it's tight. I can't make it. So yeah. 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 
Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. All right. All right. Yeah. Hey guys. Um. Got home. Did my hair. Just finished filming. Well, part one of my video. I'm gonna lay my edges now. No, I'm not gonna lay my edges. I'm not gonna lay my edges today. Actually, I'm gonna do that tomorrow when I do my makeup. Take the photos to close off this here video. So, yeah, stay tuned for it. Really, really nice. Like a wavy locks. I am about to also um, kind of fix up my area where I'm doing my filming. So, I'm gonna just basically prop you guys up and show you like the behind the scenes. Yeah, let me show you what I'm working with now. You know that I purchased that today and I'm gonna remove that and I also picked up, did I show you guys? Let me check. Right, I also got this like set of floating shells that should be mounted. So I am going to go ahead and remove this frame and mount my shelves. So I am gonna show you and then my little ottoman is behind here. I'm gonna just like, the area move that outside the way and then I have a little stool and try to make it look a little bit more aesthetically pleasing. Here that's the main focal point, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and set up that now. I'm gonna probably I'm gonna buy this some of them for the floor and just the you know the dip here this section. Yeah. Yeah. And guys, if you were watching my content from 2020, you would have seen this, how I made it. And tell me if you want like an updated video on how I made this tool, it's a DIY. Um, I actually made two of them. This was out on the outside, so the other one, somebody break it. First child remain nameless. Who broke it? <laughs> Call me Joe the Builder. Thumbnail. Comes with so I I'm supposed to have some more of those. So guys, I always have these. I always try to have these hardware hooks. So these guys are actually renters friendly. They actually don't leave any holes in the walls. So if you're renting, I would um, recommend that you get some of these. So instead of driving like big nails into the walls, I'm the picture frames, and these are very good. Oh. Alright guys, so I have had these like laying around but I'm not loving the color so I think I'm gonna spray paint them but I'm just gonna put them up to see like test run. So put them in a bowl. I'm gonna spray paint them in gold eventually. Let me tell me I walk from I'm walking around the house to see what I have. I can move and put them up there. So first thing when you're doing any renovation, any little DIY, shop in your house before you go to go buy anything. Cause trust me, you'll always find something in and around your house where you can actually use. finish sorry it's a final look I had these already in uh, my bedroom so I didn't bother to spray the other ones I just took them out repurposed them I'm gonna actually spray this in gold 
so I could probably put it here. I was thinking of getting that. Oh, it can't all. Oh, Lord. All right, here. So I'm gonna put it too much. Gonna be too crowded? Yeah, I think so. This alone should be good. But I wanted to get a candle. Um, I remember going to True Valley and uh, seeing some candles which I know would be perfect for here. So this is just temporary until I get something. But yeah, so this is the area. Thank you guys for sticking around until the end of the video guys remember to like comment and subscribe my name is jody and i aspire to inspire until next time guys what good